In San Jose, there are growing calls to make city streets safer for pedestrians. Yeah, that city is marking nearly 50 traffic deaths so far this year. Crown Force Justin Campbell spoke with neighbors who are really asking for change. We're in the Cambrian neighborhood, just blocks away from Reed Elementary School. And if you look behind me, you can see here at Corning Drive and Chambers, there are no stop signs. San Jose police say there haven't been any wrecks, but according to neighbors, just this morning, there was one. Nest video caught the moment this white Mercedes crashed into a blue Subaru. <laughs> Loud crash first thing in the morning, and uh, one of the cars looked totaled. Josh Converse says he worries because there are no stop signs. Another neighbor feels the same. A lot of times, cars are going very fast, and given that there is no stop sign, cars can easily come and collide to each other. Like what happened Friday morning, but according to San Jose police, this crash where the airbags went off never happened. The San Jose police, I reached out to them and they said that there was not even a wreck here. Uh, I can't really speak to that. There were definitely police vehicles here. I saw two wrecked cars. There was a tow truck. Cronford reached out to San Jose police in an email. SJPD said no crash occurred and frankly asking us if we're sure is disingenuous. They need to do something. They cannot just deny an accident um, didn't happen. Yasser Jelani has also complained to the city three times and is hoping stop signs will be put up for safety. I have three kids and I don't want to be a victim. You can hear the sound of the crash in the video. You can also see the squad cars in the pictures. We'll be taking that to San Jose police to figure out exactly why they're saying no crash occurred here. Reporting in San Jose, Justin Campbell, Cron 4 News.